You ready? You ready? Good. All right, ready to go here. Round one here is Anthony Showtime Pettis. More than a dozen first round finishes to his credit. Supremely dangerous. Yeah. Massive right yeah. knee. What a wild start to this fight. Yeah. Massive push on defense. What a great fight so far. These guys are laying it all out on the line. Oh, he lands a massive kick here. Front kick to the body is there. Nice work by Fizzy. And there he goes, lands another combination. His cardio is so good that, is, that it allows him to put forth this type of output and pace. When his opponent is done at two, he is stringing together four, five, six more different strikes. You don't do that without having fantastic cardio. Oh! Big knee there. Just over three minutes to go in that first round. Oh, they're trading huge shots here. We'll see who's the last one to stand. That was a huge shot there, DC. I'm not sure how he stayed up there. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, to stay standing shows and talk to your tough. Oh, that's big. All right, so the uppercuts have been a big part of the storyline in this one, but the setups have really been key for him. He's not telegraphing that strike, and the opponent hasn't been able to adjust. He has not been able to see them. It's a very tricky punch, especially in the way that he throws it. He throws it at a time when he expects so many different strikes, but it's because he has such a vast knowledge of just finding that strike. like it's cut. Yes, it is starting to bleed a little bit now. Heavy leather landed on both sides in that exchange. Big roundhouse now just misses. Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked. The hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. 45 seconds to go here in round one. Well, Pettis' lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swell. 30 seconds. 20 seconds left. Throws that team. Nice job by him defensively there. Oh, heavy kick to the body. Round two next. All right, so that's the end of the round. Potential adversity here. He's got a cut on his cheek sustained from that strike in the round. Now the focus becomes maximizing these 60 seconds. Shutting. All right, so there's the horn. He got knocked down by a punch in that round, but he is able to survive. We'll see if they can make some adjustments. You ready to fight? Ready. Go. Round two on the way. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Well, Pettis' nose is bleeding now. Yes, looks as though he got cut by one of those offerings from his opponent. Beautiful setup to the leg kick. Good defense blocking that punch. Well, you know this is the hurt business, and both of Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that finish. Oh, big left.
All right, we now go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest at one minute, 23 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Rafael Alamazian! Well, he's smiling ear to ear, and why not after a knockout like that? I need a ticket to the after party tonight. I mean, this is what dreams are made of. You dream of the knockout like this, and then the party after where you and all your coaches get to celebrate the great handiwork.